uh, Welcome to Hell is very appropriate, considering the circumstances. So naturally, if we're building a tropical island retreat, um, it's going to be an awful dictatorship. Uh, so we're going to force all these guys to do the labor. And we're going to see how we get on with building like an island paradise. So everyone just, oh god, it's chugging already. But like, someone is like just leading the way and like, that's not me. I'm going to go left here. <laughs> it's just going to be me and this like, uh, like Tam in my boat. And we're just gonna set up, like, a new life over here. Can you really call yourself a dictator if you don't force them to build the island from the ocean floor up? That's a fair point. So, we're gonna need some folks to dive on down and just kind of raise some initial height uh, for us to get started with. Uh, now, a big job I'm gonna have for some folks a little bit later, and I'll just spend some dirt soon for this. Um, it's gonna look really weird if the island, like, is literally just floating. So I'm gonna have some folks, like, build an entire dirt bank all the way down to make this look as natural as possible. Uh, this guy who's just built all the way up, too, I, I don't know why he's done this. This is too high. So, have a nice trip. Uh, anyone can't go on above this height will be p very painfully killed. Um, as I'm about to demonstrate on this poor fellow up here. <laughs> he jumped. Okay. We need food. <laughs> we'll give you guys, like, seeds that you can then use on, like, the great mighty, like, farm. And that's how we'll get, like, everyone fed. They will die before stuff grows? Well, they're gonna just have to get planting crops fast then. Okay? That's not my problem. You know, the food is here. They just gotta make it themselves. Wait, did the server die? Oh, cap at 150. Do, do we go to one? Like, if we go to 150, we're effectively half in it. Like, we've effectively like snapped this, like all the people on the server. Do we go for perfect balance? <laughs> like, let's see which side you fall on. Like, best of luck to all of you. <laughs> I'll see some of you in the soul stone. <laughs> okay, well, look, I I think we're okay from here. Okay, do we just have to be mindful of like the soul stone fighting back. That's fine. So let's just like kind of keep marking the perimeter. Uh, try not to go too high up or you will be eaten alive. Okay, so this is looking really good already. We already have like a farm being set up to actually feed the people. Can we make a like a little dock area using like this little hut here? This could actually be really good. If we make it so that like the water kind of comes in here, we can have like a, like, a nice little opening. Where, where the boats come in. Farm made by New, New Zealand. Not to be mistaken for New Zealand. That's a different place that doesn't exist. This is my favorite podcast. I, I freaking love when we do the build day stuff because I it, it's very much a different tone whenever we're doing something like this because we actually have an objective. And like the challenge is not so much like can we destroy everything or like brute force something. It, it The challenge is can we just make this work? And like, like literally I like, kind of coordinate like a herd of cats. If someone wants to make like a little figure, this like we can convert this into like a mini Statue of Liberty or something. It's kind of got that color scheme going for it. What did this guy spell? Wait. Oh god damn it! It's send nudes. Why do they always? Do? I'm gonna like, keep this bit here. So now it says end nudes. There we go. I, I quite like I quite like the aesthetic that he's gone for here with like the the logs and like these planks. So I'm gonna say that like we just expand that and like let that house cover all of this top half of town. Oh god! Wait, is this the Keck monument? He doesn't have a face on. The He's facing the wrong way. It this guy is just like overlooking like the entire island. Oh wow, people are building stuff under here. What on earth? Hello. People have, like, a little dwelling under here. What if we, like, encase all of this space below the island and we set up, like, a shanty town or, like, a slum underneath the entire island where people have, like, homes stacked on top of each other? And then we have, like, the upper class kind of residential just above land. Classism. <laughs> well, I mean, this is a rootless dictatorship on this island, you know? And listen, we don't have a lot of space to actually, like, kind of have well, for the workers to live so just put them under the place you know what are people doing over here 666 six, six, go 
Hey, Radical. Uh, what is going on here? Why is there a massive bridge? This is a place to mourn for those who snapped. <laughs> oh my god. So this is... Oh, hey, Tom Nook. How's it going? <laughs> if you so wish, place a torch on these blocks to pray for those lost in the snapping. <laughs> Okay, let us let us light a candle and pay respects to those we lost along the way. This tree was planted in memory of of Shauner. Died by a snap. Oh god, yeah, guys, we're gonna need a lot more memorial trees in the garden. Like a lot of people died in that snap. Uh, do, we can't just kill the population again. I feel like we lost like a lot of them already. What was that? Oh no, the things are back. Okay, well, just keep working, you know? Like, we're paying you by hour. Oh, wow, okay, so people have planted, like, a bunch of, like, kind of reeds under here, too. This is really coming along for, like, an underwater shanty town. Like, you guys are very much just free to do whatever here. Someone just built, like, a temple down here as well? Uh. Hello. Hey, James, how's it going? There's <laughs> a revolution? Why is there a revolt? Who are we snapping? Where's the revolution? End this tyranny. I, I don't see anyone actually revolting though, everyone looks fine. The revolution is so unimportant you can't even see it. Welcome to Vault 666 Go, your safe new portable home. <laughs> Notice board, check for daily news. Hey guys, is it me or is it a bit hot in here? Who forgot to turn off the generators? That could have so easily blown. <laughs> they died. Ah, that's an interesting journey to freedom um, you're making there. Um, you know, like an interesting like kind of bid to escape the island. RT is God Fraser. Kill me, please. End my suffering, RT. Statue. Let it be known that Lucan had to log off the server, so please keep the legacy alive by making this hut great. <laughs> Love you, RT. They say he logged off, but... He probably got snapped. You guys keep like making a big deal about like the revolution and there's being a fire. Like, is this revolution just like a one guy who's like fiercely upset about the direction the island's going? And he's just like, I'll make them all pay! And, uh, and uh, like, I'm gonna start a revolution! And it's just one fella doing it. And like no one else is paying him any mind, like he's just sitting in a corner. RT doesn't respect those who create his island. RT doesn't give us freedom, we work 25-7. There are barely any trees for slots to climb. Relatable slot. RT didn't put me in creative. I looked forward to that so much. He's alright, but he refuses to stream Fortnite. <laughs> okay, good luck, fellas. Naughty children will get the lava bucket. It's true! You know, only good parenting techniques. That's why we set our kids on fire. Call the fire department. Is this the revolution again? Is the revolution like happening again where it's like, I'm gonna get the island. And he just like set a dustbin on fire. Snap the rebel scum. Oh, I'd snap him twice. Just to make sure we get both halves of them. You will not suppress me. I stand for my rights. That's cute. This guy's just backing up. I can't sleep better island. All Minecrafters are equal here. Hey look, it's Squidward. It just, you get to see him when he's dead inside. The real Spongebob. Oh no. Uh, okay buddy, I'm gonna be honest with you, this doesn't look great for you. I'm gonna give you a chance, if you wanna try jump. It's just like at like a seaside resort, like at war. Like that's what this has become. Like, look, rebel, my name, net, my, my name, Jeff, Nate. Je <laughs> a bunch of that. <laughs> it's uh, like we're just like trying to be like good, responsible parents on this island. I build like a nice place to bring you up, and like all the rebels are like, like you're not in control of my life anymore. I'm twelve now. Why do I have to come home at midnight, Mom? Jake doesn't have to come home at midnight. He gets to stay out all night. Like, Jake gets to play P like video games until, like, 1 in the morning. He has a PS4 and an Xbox One. 
Why do you hate me so much? You only bought me a Wii U. Like, why won't you buy me the iPhone XX Plus edition? I only have the iPhone XX. Well, son, we think that's a very respectable phone already, you know? Like, very expensive to buy a new iPhone every year. Why do you hate me? I I'm honestly really happy with how this has gone. Like, I think the base looks really nice. Someone did write a Despacito over there, which kind of makes me want to set it all ablaze. But apart from that, Archie took the kids, he took all of them. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Why do you guys keep saying I took the kids? <laughs> I don't understand that one. <laughs> like, it sounds really bad. <laughs> There's only so many polar bears a rebel resistance can face before they are quickly overwhelmed. Oh, good God, this is the tree base that Spike was talking about. Wait, this is a rebel sky base? <laughs> Okay, everyone come up here for the group photo. That's where we're gonna take it. We're gonna get, like, the last shot before we wrap up the stream. Oh no, people are just falling. People are just... No, guys. Don't chop them off, they can't get back. We're losing them. I'm just going to the glacier now. I'm gonna- I'm gonna get my own photo. 